to walk out with it. Nothing? You got it. What is it? What is it? I don't know. Paku. Paku, it's impossible. Paku doesn't eat. Um... Tell that to the Paku. Paku doesn't eat fish. Tell that to the Paku. What? Tell that to the Paku. Okay, first of all, inside here is all bone. Here. This is a Paku. This is a Paku. Okay. Notice the thickness of the lower lip. Okay. See this distance here? See how thick that is? That's for scraping algae. This distance right here, this thickness. Piranha is extremely small. Now, he does have some pointed teeth here. But again, how many? One, two, three on each side. Notice how the front teeth here are straight across. And a piranha, they come out to an oval. Okay? That's a paku. Easier to tell by this this hinge here, this jaw hinges down here, straight across, straight line across this way. Front teeth are straight across the front. Whoa. And I got force water through his gills. I used to call that walking a fish. And you didn't walk him very far. Here, come back. He's gone. He's gone. What do you think these piranhas eat in the wild? They don't. They don't look. They don't look skinny at all. No, they're not malnourished. But I really can't imagine how many pounds of meat that they eat today. Yeah. What do you say? Twelve kilos total. Twelve kilos total pieces. But where can they find something that is twelve kilos there? Or I don't see five. a capybara. I don't see anything that you know. That I don't even see bones there. Leftover or nothing. Well, I don't see them. They don't have the temperament to go around and eat Tetris, you know? They're not ambush predators, to my knowledge. So they gotta be carrion eaters, you know, dead Okay, um, tell me what potential um, prey they have there. Each other? That was just That's what I was thinking. I was, yeah. I, was I just yeah. read my mind. I was thinking there. Then I, I'm, I'm thinking that there, there probably wouldn't be a lot of them left. If they ate each other. But well, proportionally less each day, but you don't know when do they start with. So, if that were the case, if it were the case that that's how they survived, then nature would provide them to have enough to get through, which means nature would give them more than enough. They at least need a bite a day, probably, to yeah. be in that shape. Yeah. Right. And then they don't seem. When, when you see them schooling around, it doesn't seem like they eat anything. Yeah. I mean, you see the ir the irritants feeding, you know. Yeah, they're scale eaters. Yeah, the scale eaters, but... You see the hopeless feeding, you know. The yeah, the, the pikes. Yeah. The peacock yeah, feeding. The peacock bats you know, feeding I've never the seen these things feeding wildly. Yeah. Don't know. There's dunes here. Old dunes. Yeah. Chan took some sand of this and put him in his aquarium. It looks beautiful. Okay, so we either go, we, option one is we could leave for Ayacucho now. Just boogie. We'd get there by 7 o'clock. 7 o'clock. Yeah, we can do that. You 
understand that everything that we do um, is leaves a record for the future, right? Like you, we people that can in the future can see the video can see if there's a difference in population of the Kariwa. Sure. Yeah. Right. Yeah. If, how much water, how clear it was? If it's left, if, it, if it's in somehow left in, in, a, in a scientific footprint that's accessible. Yeah. I mean, not if, it, not if it, you know, I put it on my bookshelf and it dies with me, or you, you know. Exactly. Move to exactly. New York and put it in the trunk in an attic of a house, then it's, then it's worthless. And it's worthless. So you really have to make it part of the public record somehow in order for that to be relevant. Okay. I think it's very relevant. You know, after because we're, we're we're documenting everything. We're we're documenting insects and you know yeah. and, and plants and birds. Yeah, but you have to you have to really in theory. But I really think you have to take much better notes and leave much better details. I mean, for example, you pick up your video camera and nowhere in the videotape. Oh, now there is. Is there a GPS? Water parameters. Water parameters. Well, yeah, that's just a piece of data which we're ignoring. But even... Well, we have to start taking them. We have all the... Yeah, but let's let's assume... Okay, we just took footage under that ditch in that mud puddle. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. Okay? There was nothing in there. But, you know, I got a picture of a pike and a couple of cichlids and a, and a tetra. Yeah. Um, Well, this, this this would be the stupidest record, but on the video that I was taking, it's a pretty short video, but you can see that it was raining. So if you have the date, you know that it, at least it rained that day, right? Yes, but that's but no one would, you know, would go back to sleep. No, I mean, no, no one would ever, no one ever cross foot like that unless you know you're being arrested for murder or something. And your excuse was that it was a bright sunny day. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. but yeah. You know, but no, it's a much more logical thing. They should have taken the water parameter, temperature, and everything. That, that's a piece of data, but you got to store it in a means that it's going to be accessible. You know what I'm saying? I mean, there might be a DNA library. I don't know of a video library where you can subject your films to with, with file parameters that have got, I mean, these files are marked with, with, with GPS locations. All right. Well, uh, Mattel is telling me that now pictures and videos are taking into scientific research. Yes, can be used for descriptive. For descriptive, evidence. exactly. But my point is that if you if you think this is going to be relevant to something, you're not. And, and we have to make it. Public. You have to you have to introduce it into the public record somehow. Yep. And, and through Machado is probably a good way to do it. Yep. So that if somebody 100 years from now wants to study feeding habits of Caribe or something, they could somehow find a footnote in some article in some publication yep. that would lead him to the article that was sitting in, you know. Or to the video. I mean, if you really want to know the behavior. Well, yeah, but you have to have the video, but the, 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 you know, the, it's got to be in the public record somehow. Yeah. Buenas tardes. Stop us. <laughs>